Well, hello everybody and welcome back to my playthrough of Final Fantasy VII Remake and... Well, I tried to take a rest in the last episode, but it will not let me. I had to go through that door. As you can see, Absu is absolutely gone now. Hmm. That's not a breakable box. Yeah, I didn't get a chance to check things in between battles, but... Yeah, looks like we do have to take this door. You alright, Leslie? You okay? Where's Cornell? Sorry. Sorry. Bastard got away. It's fine. I'll track him down eventually. Not like I have anything better to do. You know, I wouldn't be so sure about that. She could still be out there. Yeah. Can never be sure how much someone means to you till they're gone. Mm -hmm. Don't give up on her yet. Was it a message? That's a bin. What was she trying to tell me? Pink clown nose. We'll meet again. Huh. It's a symbol of reunion. Huh. And I guess I've got no choice but to find her first. Hmm. Thanks. Hold up. Hold up. I think you might be forgetting something. I haven't. Found it. Oh. Let's get out of here. Let's do and then I'll give you what you need. Okay. Okay. Alright, that just leads back to Absu. So I'm guessing we should. Yeah, we should head back up. Besides, there's a side quest I need to finish. And maybe one more try at push-ups. Well, pull-ups, I mean. I couldn't really do one in real life without having a wall help me. <laughs> so it's no surprise I suck at pull-ups in this game. At least, in the pro difficulty. <laughs> this way. This way. Oh, so that was a secret passage to the sewers. Grappling guns. Oh. You can, you can practically fly with the souped up motors on these babies. Sector 7 is on the other side of that wall. The guns will get you over and past it, along with any number of other obstacles. Ah. But they're one-way tickets. Yeah, once we get going. So once you start up, there's no coming back. You should probably get your affairs in order, just in case. All right. Thank you. In other words, complete all your side quests and. Didn't tell you before, but we're looking for someone too. Is that right? Yeah. And she's special to us. Just like Hope you find it. You too.
Not yet. I'm pretty sure I saw a treasure that I wanted to grab. Oh yeah, there is a treasure right over here. Ooh, three moogle medals. So yeah, before I move on, I should head over to Marl's turn and finish this one last side quest. Well, odd job. Because remember what they said, once you, once we use those grappling guns, we can't go back. Don't tell anyone. So any business that you haven't completed yet, you should absolutely do so. Alright, there shouldn't be much in the way, so I'll hoof it. Besides, it's the very last side quest. I might as well finish it. I wonder if it was faster to do this or to just take a chocobo. Oh, what brings you here? Mm. Gifts from an angel. They're to be used to help the people of Sector 7 rebuild. The angel of the slums? You didn't meet her, did you? We know her. Tell me, what was she like? Never met her. Just her go-between. A shame. Oh, bless her sweet soul. I don't know what to say. I'll make sure the funds are put to good use. Here, why don't you take this? Something tells oh. me you can use it more than me. So that was Cloud's sword plea. And we completed a secret stash quest. Yeah, I wanted to rest up. Just got out of the sewers. I don't think you had a chance to rest up. Alright, so that's 24 clear, so... So there must be more. I thought, I... thought that was it, but... Yeah, I'm going to check for time. I... I need to decide what, yeah, I think, yeah, I'll make a save right before I continue. Because what I want to do is, I want to at least try to complete the, the push-up, well, the pull-ups. I'll give it one last go. I want to make a separate save just for that. I don't need the belt. I do want the trophy. So having a say specifically for that might help me. I know I can always go back and do it. I just... You know what? I'll save that for post-game. Just that means always gonna leave an in niche in me. But I might as well power up the Mithril Saber all I can. Hmm. Actually I do wanna get this magic attack power plus ten. Now I can make Cloud a a decently strong mage. Security team walks right into 
Wait a minute. Actually, there is one thing I should do. There's materia I need to complete. So I think what I'll do is actually... Oh wait, that's the gym. I don't want to deal with that again. It's the Coliseum I want. And actually, I do want to check... Alright, got the menu. Alright, what I'm missing is the Volume 2 menu... Volume 2 scripture for Aerith. I do not know where it is. I'm wondering what I missed to get... Alright. Missing Track 5. And Track 26. And I got 30 Moogle Medals, so... Yeah, I think what I'll do is... I'll make a trip to... Nah, I won't. I think what I want to do... Is check my Materia. Alright. The Poison Materia is almost complete, so... That'll give me 8. For Barret. Well, the Subversion Materia is two-thirds of the way there. Barrier Materia is more, more than halfway there. And Tifa... Ooh, that's a long way to go for the Revival Materia. And the Time Materia is going to take some time too. So... What I'm going to do is, I'm going to AP grind to finish that last battle intel, and I'll, I'll be back. Hmm? Are you here for a workout? Okay, let's have some fun. Finally! <laughs> no surprises there. And that should get me the trophy. And the champion belt. I couldn't have asked for a better <sighs> Alright. Now that I got that trophy out of the way, there's one more itch I want to scratch. Now I haven't finished my grinding yet, but as far as the battle intel goes, only got one ma one magic materia left, and that happens to be the revival materia. That's going to take a while, but with this AP up materia I got from walking 5,000 steps to turn the pedometer into it, there's a battle in the well in the Colosseum I can do that'll net me 55 AP. It's the one where you fight in in a free person battle. It it's actually one AP higher than the 
than the super well than the bow with the variants and it doesn't take it as long so i would recommend that one it's a free star one so so just look for the free star one with a three person team up and you'll be fine but the itch i'm looking to scratch is there's a trophy for gain that an angel's calling card it's a hidden trophy and since I just completed the what uh, well the odd job for Don Caneo's fortune and decided to give those tiaras tomorrow to help rebuild sector 7 I know that Muriel's in the church. So we might as well let her know. I hear Corneo's got secret rooms hidden in the sewers. More than even he knows if the rumors are true. That reminds me, someone spotted a tacky looking door over by the collapsed expressway. Yeah, but if you're curious, there's another door that's got Corneo's emblem and everything on it. Right by the angel's hideout. I hear Corneo's got secret rooms hidden in the right, sewers. So... More than even he knows if the rumors are true. So the itch I was looking to scratch shall remain so. Well, shall remain unscratched. I think I can check the angel's hideout just to make sure. There is a hidden trophy, a hidden trophy that says you get uh, says gain a calling card from an from an angel, and I'm assuming that's the angel of the slums. If I'm wrong, I'll have to look it up. And I'll probably do that at the beginning of the next episode after I finish my grinding. But I'm just glad I got that those pull ups out of the way. Then you have to be practically perfect just to. Have a chance to succeed. I thought I wouldn't because I fell behind and somehow at the last moment caught up. All right, let's see if I remember right. Uh, I mean, that's not the marsh. Let's see, that's the cemetery. Yeah, I think this is. Yeah, I think it's lookout point. Alrighty. I'm guessing I went the wrong way, but. Ooh, actually, that is the wrong way. This is the right way. Wow, it's like this game knows what happens in real life. What news? The angel of the slums stole Corneo's fortune and gave it to the people of Sector 7. Ha <laughs> ha! The hero that Midgar needs. That's it. I've made up my mind. I'm quitting the paper and going freelance. Mm. I'm going to write exclusively about our resident angel. As an independent, I may need to ask for your help again down the line. I'd appreciate any and all cooperation. Well, that's a sensible choice. It's amazing. I've never felt so passionately about anything in my entire life. All right, so ooh, maybe I should talk to Damon earlier. But well, it's nice to hear that he's not going to prop up a evil organization like Shinra. Who got antidote? And is instead going independent. And there is no. Alright. 
a couple of lesser drinks. Whoa. Those tornadoes, though. Us all. Wow, basic cure spell doing that. Yeah, I think this is the way I need to go. I'll raise some smogger, but maybe, just maybe. Finish that quick. <laughs> No holding back. Oh yeah, another one in the bag. All right, now I got self-destruct. It's just one that I shouldn't use because I mean, it's self-destruct. You're basically blowing yourself up. Hmm. Alright, so yeah. I think I'll just go back to Muriel again. I mean, talking to the demon really might might have helped with this. Alright, quickest way is the way I came in. Yeah, I want to head to the church. I talk to demon. Yeah, I hope that means. That reminds me, someone spotted a tacky-looking door over by the collapsed expressway. Yeah, but I believe I took care of everything. So yeah, I think I. Yeah, so. Oh wait, I'm not supposed to step on the flowers. I'm gonna call it an episode here. I'm gonna finish my grinding. Look up what I need to do to finish this trophy, and well, next episode I hope to get started on the climb up to Shimra headquarters. So until then, I want you to have a good day. Hopefully, I catch you in the next video. But until then, stay safe and thank you for watching, everybody.